Hi everybody. Okay, now today's question is, what makes a good friendship? Okay, now I have, I consider, I've got friends which I've known 30 years plus. They are my good friends. Now think about what makes, what makes our friendship so good, okay? Now, I think about my friends and the different things I get from my friends. I think from all my friends, we get an exchange of laughter. We make each other laugh and everything. And some of them, you know, I've got certain friends who, you know, if I've got a problem, I can go and talk to them and they'll sit down, they'll give me advice and everything. Some, you know, it could be different reasons, but what I've found what makes a good friendship is that exchange. There's a mutual and even exchange of something. Like I say, it could be an exchange of laughter. It could be an exchange of emotional support. You know, it could be something as simple as um, one, you got two friends, one's a doctor, one's a lawyer. So one calls up one when they need medical advice, the other one calls the other one when they need advice on law. And they have those conversations, but at the same time, because they're having those conversations and they've got that equal exchange of information, they can develop a friendship and they can meet up and they can talk about other things as well. But they both feel satisfied within their relationship because they're getting something out of each other. Now, I'm not saying, you know, you get your friends by thinking, what can I get out of this person? It's not like that. It just kind of happens naturally. Naturally, friends, you get, there's a mutual exchange of something. Like, I'm sure there's people out there who are in a scenario where they've got that one person they know, which they see that person as a friend, but this so-called friend only calls them up when they want something. They want some, oh, some information, oh, you know. For example, let's say somebody is, uh, I don't know, they work within the law, they're a solicitor, and every time this person calls up, they say, oh, listen, um, you know, I'm buying a house, could you, um, uh, you know, help me with the papers, or, oh, look, I've got a friend that's in trouble, you know, or, you know, this person's giving me a hard time at work, you know, what's the law around this, and blah, blah, and every time they ring that person, it's for some sort of advice on law, and they're never giving anything back to that person, it's just completely one-sided, and they only ring that person when they want something. That's no longer a friendship. You're not you're, you're not having that mutual exchange, that even exchange, the equal exchange of whatever it is. Like, it could be anything. Like I said before, laughter, emotions, information, you know, just somebody to talk to, someone to listen. You know, you could just... I've got friends which I can talk to about certain things. I've got friends I just laugh about certain things. I've got friends which, you know... I will ask for advice on things and, and I hope that they can come to me as well for advice on whatever it is. But there needs to be that mutual exchange in order for the friendship to develop. That's how friendships work, in my opinion. You can't have a one-sided friendship because eventually you'll get tired of that and that no longer becomes a friendship. So in conclusion, Friends need to be, the friendship needs to be equal. It's going to be hard on anyone if a friend is just taken, 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 taken and never giving back. That no longer becomes a friendship. It needs that mutual exchange. So look at your friendships and think to yourself, it may sound bad, but think what am I getting out of this person? Are they supporting me? emotionally or are they supporting me giving me laughter or 
You know, are they there for me with advice or something? What are you getting out of them? And what are you giving back as well? You know, it's not just about taking, it's about what you're giving as well. So let me know if you're in a one-sided friendship. You know, think about your friendship. Have you got somebody like that who just calls you when they want something? Because if they do, they're not really a friend. You know, maybe you need to look into what that friendship really is. Is it a friend or is it a friend? I'll try to answer all the comments, reply to all the comments in this channel. It's a small channel, so we can get, I've got, hopefully be able to find time to get through them all and we can carry on this conversation in the future, okay? But take care and watch out for your friends.